Nigerians are being entreated to exemplify their virtues and promote unity for peaceful coexistence as a country general election approaches. Lead pastor of Higher Life Chapter of Assembly of God at Sokoban Samuel Kwisiya charged the electorate to heed to the biblical call to be peacemakers and ensure that anarchy finds no foothold. Speaking on the role of the church and Christians in ensuring a successful selection of leaders for the country, Pastor Kwesi Amua indicated nothing should justify chaos in the 2024 polls. The, the over 250 active members of the Higher Life Chapel of Assembly of God in Sokoban in the Ashanti region gathered for their 10th anniversary celebration. Lead Pastor Samuel Kwesi Amua is charging Christians and Ghanaians to seek transformation and exercise their voting rights peacefully. He admonishes the electorate to be diligent in picking a virtuous leader. We are charging and challenging ourselves as Christians to bring our values and our virtues to bear in this season. Uh, let's unite ourselves and go through this period peacefully. Let's be the agents of peace. Uh, the scripture tells us, blessed are the peacemakers. Nothing should guarantee any form of anarchy. As we get closer to this year's election too, I want to say that let's seize the opportunity to drum home the message of the cross. I believe if Ghanaians receive this message, we will be transformed and we will not need to do hand picking and also be doing firefighting because the message of the cross carries all of these that as a nation we are believing God for. He made these comments during the launch of the church's 10th anniversary themed A Decade of Higher Glory. Pastor Samuel Kwesi is indicating people of the Christian faith to stand their ground and live exemplary lives. There are too many accusations coming up today against clergy, against members of the church, against elders. And in fact, the society is fast losing the confidence that it had in the church. It is time for us to rise up as people of God and trust that we will be the light of this nation, we will be the salt of this nation. As part of the anniversary, the church will engage in prison outreach programs and provide medical and health screening. Other activities include mass evangelism in senior high schools and clean-up exercises. Godfred Smith Asante is a media head and anniversary committee member. And by the grace of God, we are 10 this year and we want to celebrate the glory of God, what the Lord has done for his people and for his church. We have missions that would be reaching out to the public, would be reaching out to the world with the gospel. Everything that we are doing actually is about Christ. We want to celebrate Christ and what Christ has done for his church and then his people. Things that we already do, but this time around we'll be touching up and adding more. We'll be going there to make donations and then all that. These are all the things that we are doing to mark higher life at 10 years and our doors are open to everyone. Reporting for Joy News, my name is Clinton Yeboah.